Okay, guys, I'm pretty sure I still have frozen yogurt up my nose somewhere, but uh, we'll <laughs> deal with that later. I can't believe you won that game. Um, I can. I'm really just, you have a little frozen yogurt right in your eyebrow. I get that frozen, <laughs> oh, thank you for doing that on live television. Um, so. Yeah, so the weather has been really bad today, and they're calling for rain for the rest of the weekend. October is normally a really rainy month. So we're going to do our top five favorite things to do in rainy weather. How about you start? Okay, um, so number five, I'd say clean sweep. You know, you're cleaning that room that you like just like walk <laughs> over the clothes and stuff. Yeah, and it's been like that for like a week and your floor has like weird feathers all over it from your pillows going everywhere. I have pillow fights like every night with my friends, obviously. Yeah, yeah. So finally, you got to get out the vacuum and actually vacuum up your floor, dust off your shelves. This is a good day today. That's number five. Okay, totally. number four. Number four, um, I would say baked goods. Making something really incredible. You have a couple hours. Yes. Maybe making like homemade macaroni and cheese with bacon. Oh. Mm. What yeah, would you yeah. make? When it's rainy outside, I know I always want to bake. I don't know how to follow the instructions. Like, <laughs> I did it one time, and instead of putting like a cup of sugar, I put a cup of salt, and it was just. What? I feel like that's not. <laughs> that could never happen to someone else. But I know. You. I wasn't. Okay, it's attention to detail. I guess. Okay, number three. Number three, um, I'm going to say mind and body. So this means okay. like have a bath, read a book, you know what I mean? Stuff like that. Take care of yourself. Totally. I have a lot of those lush bath bombs. You know, you buy them in this store and you're thinking, oh, I'll use this all the time. And it sits in your cupboard and you're like, I should really use this lavender bath bomb. So rainy yeah. days, that's the perfect time to do it. Your water's a little pink. It's really awesome. Totally. Okay, number two. Number two, um, movie marathons. Now, me and Matt have mm -hmm. something in common. We love The Tenth Kingdom. It's a six hour long movie. It's so long. It's so long, but it's unreal. It's got like fairy tales. It's got this really crazy plot line. Uh -huh. It's crazy that we both have seen it. I know. And I always try to do like Harry Potter marathons, but I only like get through like half of the first one and then like I fall asleep or something like that. <laughs> or like Lord of the Rings. Yeah, along so those lines. long. Totally. Okay, number one, our favorite thing to do. Number one thing to do when it's raining outside is to build a fort in yeah. your house, okay? I've done it when I'm six years old. I still do it now, okay? Like a castle in your house and you just get in there and you just stay there and no one can find you. I love it. I haven't done that with my roommates yet, but I totally am gonna do that when we get home tonight. Gotta do it. And it'd be like a really great like study fort, I feel. No, no studying in the fort. <laughs> Fine, no studying in the fort. All right, guys, thanks okay. for watching our episode. We had a really fun time. Make sure to follow us on Twitter at The Big Purple Couch, and we will see you next week.